football season just ended and we got so many coaching fires and retirements this week. Starting with the Seahawks, Pete Carroll just retired today. This was unexpected. I'm pretty sure we all thought he was going to return for next season. This is the dumbest decision, but the Titans fired Mike Vrabel. Another team's definitely picking him up. I don't know what the Titans are doing. Ron Rivera's done as the commander's head coach. It makes sense, though. He hasn't done much since becoming the head coach of Washington. Arthur Smith was also fired as the Falcons head coach. It makes sense because his only elite trait is wasting young talent. Also got to remember, Brandon Staley was fired as the Chargers head coach. And Josh McDaniels was fired as the Raiders head coach. So that's a total of six vacant head coaching positions. And we still don't know what's happening with Bill Belichick and the Patriots yet. I thought they would have already made a decision on whether he's going to be their head coach still or not. But it seems like they're stalling. And Hughes News just dropped in the world of college football, Nick Saban is officially retiring. After years of dominance and a total of seven national titles, Nick Saban is done from Alabama. He retired at the best time because NIL and the transfer portal have completely ruined college football.